reasons we rescue animals, and one of the ones that has the biggest impact on us, is when we're rescuing them due to human interaction, or the only reason we're rescuing them is because of something we as humans have done to impact the animal or their environment. And I have some show and tell items I wanted to show you guys. Now I'm sure you've all been driving down the local freeways and seen the plastic bags blowing around. Well those plastic bags end up in our storm drains and make their way out into our ocean environment and eventually find their ways into the animals such as uh, sea lions, dolphins and whales, sea turtles, and seabirds. Just this week, this is a plastic bag. You can see it's still pretty clean, so luckily the animal we feel hadn't been impacted by it very long. But we got a phone call that there was a pup or a young animal in San Diego County that had a plastic bag and was wearing it around its neck. So as you can see, we were able to cut the bag free and we just released or returned the animal on site. If we had not gotten that phone call from the concerned public or were able to go down and cut this plastic bag off, what probably would have happened is when the animal entered the water, this would have filled with water and really weighted that seal or sea lion down and could have become a choking hazard. We had a beautiful golden adult California sea lion that we rescued and she looked a good weight but was very lethargic and depressed and would not eat. We were having a hard time really figuring out what was going on with this animal. Three days later, she regurgitated these plastic bags. Luckily, after that, she started eating. Our veterinarians did a physical exam and did not find any more plastic bags within her. But plastic bags are a serious cause of marine debris that we see impact wildlife. One of the first sea turtles I was ever a part of rescuing, you know, I was very excited we were going to be able to help this sea turtle. We got it back to our veterinarians, and while the veterinarians were examining it, it started to defecate plastic. So this is something where we can make a difference. We have people ask us all the time, what can I do to make a difference or have an impact on ocean's health or the local health of our local wildlife? And you can do that very simply just by voting. Right now, you can make a difference by voting. And we very strongly urge you to vote yes on Proposition 67. Thank you.